there are a lot of questions coming in asking about the conversion functionality. So let's do this first. Will MathCAD Prime automatically open my MathCAD 15 worksheet? Mm, okay. Yeah, so MathCAD Prime and MathCAD 15 do have two different file formats. And so uh, there is a conversion process that we, that we have to use in order to convert the MathCAD 15 file format into a format that can be opened by MathCAD Prime. So uh, the, conver the converter functionality is initiated from MathCAD Prime. There's a converter button in the MathCAD Prime user interface. We use that converter to convert the MathCAD 15 Prime or the MathCAD 15 file into MathCAD Prime. So it doesn't natively open the MathCAD 15 file, uh, but it does open it after it's been converted. And just to be clear, when we convert MathCAD 15 files into MathCAD Prime files, the MathCAD 15 file remains untouched. It's not, it's not altered in any way. It's not replaced by a new file for MathCAD Prime. Uh, it remains untouched and intact, and a brand new file for MathCAD Prime is created. So, so that's the answer to that question, David. Thank you. So a lot of people are trying to use the converter today and they want they've may perhaps they've tried to use the converter in past versions of MathCAD Prime. So they they're wondering have there been any improvements to the converter with MathCAD Prime 7? Mm, okay. Yeah, so I would say there that the the fidelity of the conversion process is is significantly better than it was in earlier versions of MathCAD Prime. There are a couple of factors that go into this. The first is that as, as more functionality is added to MathCAD Prime and more gaps are closed between MathCAD 15 and MathCAD Prime, the converter fidelity improves naturally because more things can be converted. The other thing is that uh, earlier versions of the converter did, did uh, alter the layout of the of the worksheet, uh, quite probably more than we would like. Uh, a lot of extra space was added. The size of 2D plots was uh, increased. Those kinds of things have also been addressed in uh, the last couple of versions of MathCAD Prime. So um, the layout of the worksheet is much more consistent now. Uh, MathCAD Prime now has custom page margins. So when you're converting from MathCAD 15, the page margins will match. That improves the fidelity of the layout during the conversion process. So uh, there have been significant improvements to the, conver the converter and the conversion process, uh, and the MathCAD Prime files are more consistent now with the layout of the original MathCAD 15 files. Um, and that's, again, that's due to more things being converted uh, from MathCAD 15 to Prime, and then a lot of a uh, cleanup effort as well that's been put into the converter. So I think that earlier versions of the converter, um, you know, may have may have altered the layout a little bit more again than we would like. And recent versions of MathCAD Prime are are much uh, better when it comes to conversion. All right. And to clarify, Angie, do you need MathCAD 15 installed in order to use the converter in MathCAD Prime 7? Ah, yes. Okay. So up to MathCAD Prime 6, you do need MathCAD 15 installed. With MathCAD Prime 7, we actually uh, have a standalone converter. So with MathCAD Prime 7, you, you don't need MathCAD 15 installed. Uh, and so, <clears throat> so that's a nice thing about MathCAD Prime 7. You can convert your MathCAD 15 files into MathCAD Prime without the need to have MathCAD 15 installed on the computer at the same time. That's, again, that's, that's added in MathCAD Prime 7. Thank you for that, Angie. How long will MathCAD Prime maintain the ability to convert MathCAD 15 files? I I don't I don't think that there are any 
there's any reason to uh, remove that capability. So, so as far as I know, as far as I know, uh, MathCAD Prime will be able to convert MathCAD 15 files, um, you know, in, indefinitely. That's that's what I would say about that. So, um, so even though MathCAD 15, even though MathCAD 15 is moving to end of sale at the end of this year. That means that you know that means that we can't sell new subscriptions or subscription renewals for MathCAD 15 at, at the end of this year. However, the MathCAD 15 content that you have now is yours, and the uh, and we are able to give you the ability to convert that content into MathCAD Prime uh, beyond the end of this year. So that's di disconnected. The conversion is disconnected from the end of sale. Um, and so, so I don't, right now, I'm not aware of any plans to discontinue supporting conversion of MathCAD 15 files into MathCAD Prime. All right. And let's say you have previous files not in MathCAD 15, but perhaps an earlier version. How far back can the files be converted? So uh, the, conver the conversion will convert barely old MathCAD 15 files. Um, and I'm going to say, going back to MathCAD 8, uh, so th that's as far back as we have tested. Um, but we have successfully been able to convert files going back to version 8 into MathCAD Prime. And so um, the converter does go back pretty far. Um, and so I'm, I'll just, I, I don't, I can't say certainly it's one version or another, um, but I think that the ballpark version that, that we can talk about as far as how far back we can go when it comes to conversion would probably be around version eight. 